Hey guys, we're at Max London's flagship store to chat to senior makeup artist Debbie Finnegan, who's worked on stars from Grace Jones to Pixie Lot, so she knows what she's talking about. So Debbie's going to be showing us how to recreate the hottest makeup trends for spring. We're going to be uploading them over the next couple of weeks, so make sure you subscribe to MTV's YouTube channel to stay up to date with all of her beauty secrets. Okay, so talk us through what we're doing today. It's a no makeup look that takes quite a bit of makeup to make it look like there's no makeup, if that sort of makes sense. It's more of like a natural look. Yes. Okay. Natural, spring summery. Yeah. I'm excited. Let's try it. Cool. We're going to make you look nice and glowy first of all. So should you always start with skin first? Do you know what? It really kind of depends, but I mean, it does give you a good sort of canvas or a good base to sort of work on, and I think that's definitely going to be the basis of our no makeup makeup look. Right. <laughs> um, so, I mean, all we've done so far on you is we've just kind of prepped your skin and we've put a little bit of um, our mineralized moisture rich foundation. Um, it just evens out the skin, it just makes you look nice and sort of um, flawless and, um, and perfects the skin just a little bit. And then we're adding a little bit of um, some luminosity and this is with some um, MAC cream colour base. I'm mixing two colours together called Luna and Pearl. Okay. And if we just apply those to the top of the cheeks and then like through the bridge of the nose, anywhere basically where the sun or the light would kind of head a little bit like on the lips and on the chin here, mm. it just brightens. It's like adding a little bit of candlelight on the skin. Where would I use this makeup look? Like is this more of a day look or? I think that you can take elements or inspiration from any looks that you see. So I think for this kind of thing, like maybe find the elements that you like the best, figure out what products that you need to be able to recreate that element and just add that one or two product to your makeup bag and you've instantly got a new look. This is a penultimate brow marker from MAC and it's basically like a felt tip pen for filling in your eyebrows. So what we're going to do is just randomly give you a couple of little freckles here and there. So is this a trend? Is it have, have people been using these like freckles on the catwalk? Well, backstage at um, Fashion Week for Spring Summer, I mean in the preen show, the, um, it was yeah. one of the shows that we seen that freckles were showcased. Um, Val Garland um, recreated the, the look of sun-kissed skin basically um, yeah. and, and drew on freckles using like a, a few different products. Okay. So I think it's something that's easy for like somebody to be able to recreate as well, which is kind of nice. And how do you choose like what shades to do the freckles in? So it's got to be quite fair for me because I'm super pale. Well, or are you doing quite dark ones? These are kind of light ones. I mean, most people's freckles are sort of like a like a taupey colour or like a sort of tanny colour. So this is just um, a warmer pencil now. This is a lip pencil called Strip Down. Because we're doing a, a, a montage of freckles, I'm, I'm on my second lip pencil now. This one is called Stone. Um, and the reason why you do this is just to kind of give like a more sort of realistic and more believable effect. Um, so there's just three different like neutral tones. Okay, so this is our lip conditioner. So this is, um, it's a product that we use backstage like all the time. Mm. Um, it's great for anybody who has like really dry lips. It's just a clear see-through balm, but it has sweet almond oil in it, so it makes it like really nourishing for the lips. So, I mean, if we were to sum up like this look so far, like this is the no makeup look, like we said, that takes a lot of makeup to kind of get us there. You've basically just got a really lovely natural foundation, the MAC Mineral Moisture Rich Foundation, um, and we've just kind of groomed everything else. Like we've groomed your eyebrows, put a little bit of colour in there, curled your eyelashes, cheated and gave you some extra freckles yeah. um, with some brow pencils, and then just bammed your lips and just made everything look really fresh and pretty. Yeah, I like it. Super fresh. Yeah. Ha, ha, ha.